ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Mick Bailey, and for those of you who do not know me, I am your captivating, charismatic, copper-bearded ginger, and I normally do unboxing videos for WrestleCrate UK, my favourite online wrestling bundle delivery service that provides you all of the most fantastic merchandise from the big leagues to the indies. But today I have a very special unboxing for you because during the May Bank holiday I got unbelievably drunk and my eyes wandered over to a one-off loot bundle from the people at lootbundle.com. It was a Red Dwarf inspired bundle and I love Red Dwarf, I love me some 90s comedy so I had to get one of these and see what sort of things the people from Loot Bundle offer. This is what the crate said it was going to look like. So as you can see straight off the bat this bundle doesn't look anything like it was advertised. It is merely a brown cardboard box, which is a little disappointing if I'm completely honest, because I do take these bundle crates, loot things very seriously, and that is a little bit underwhelming when I opened it up, but still it's always about the content. So let's have a look inside and see what they've sent us. So first of all, we have another cardboard box inside. We'll crack this open and it is a mug. It is a Starbug mug. Nice little item that. Starbug of the Jupiter Mining Corporation. That's pretty decent. I like that. It's a good... I mean, the printing on it's a little bit sort of like DIY. I imagine after a few washes that's going to come off. I'll be honest with you. But it is a nice mug nonetheless. Very good. See what else we've got next. We have a t-shirt white t-shirt and this features little sort of I suppose like bit strip characters of the Red Dwarf crew pretty cool t-shirt again the print I don't know how that's going to hold up after a couple of washes it does very much seem like a bit of a cut out at home and iron onto the t-shirt sort of thing and I mean there's there's not a great deal going on on that and I mean I've ordered a large and that is absolutely colossal had I known it was going to be that case. Because have you ever noticed when you order a t-shirt from anywhere, it doesn't matter if you order large, medium, they're always completely different. This is, in this occasion, a rather large t-shirt. I love the design. I just think that the print could be a little bit more high quality. But that's just nitpicking. That's just nitpicking. Next up, we have another t-shirt. This one looks quite cool. Red Dwarf Jupiter Mining Corporation t-shirt there. As you can see, it's creased, unfortunately, but... I think you can still make out the actual logo on there quite well. Again, it is, it is, it's a low quality print, I'll be honest. I'm hoping that that will hold up when it gets washed, because that is a nice t-shirt. Again, it is absolutely colossal. Um, so when ordering these, you might, in some instances, want to order a size down. If I'd known they were going to be this big, I probably would have gone with a medium one. I do prefer this t-shirt to the other one. This will probably get a lot more wear. Uh, just like I say, hoping that that logo holds up after a few washes. Next up, this looks pretty cool. They provided us with a snapback cap. It's, uh, for those of you who actually want to know where they come from, it's a Beachfield original headwear hat. They, they're pretty good. I had a few from uh, WrestleCrate that were Beach Beach Beachfield, yeah. I had, a, I had a Graps one from WrestleCrate. That says, smoke me a kipper, I'll be back for breakfast. The quote of the one and only Ace Rimmer. It's a nice hat, very nice. I mean, the only thing I would say, and I don't know if you can make this out, but some of the design just here is already flaking off a little bit. And that's that's quite disappointing. Um, like I say, this, this crate cost me $26.99. It said it was reduced from $54.99. Um, I can't so far imagine how $54.99 would come out of this. It is the good items. I just don't feel like they're going to last the test of time with a bit of wear and tear, especially the t-shirts and the mug with a wash. Um, and last but not least, oh wow, this is... <clears throat> it's a tote bag because everyone knows that Red Dwarf fans need an undersized tote bag. Um, Starbug, st sorry, sorry, Starbug Shuttle Services with the Jupiter Mining Corp logo on it. Um, yeah, 
I mean, there's not a great deal to tell you about that other than it's a, a very small tote bag. A bit underwhelmed, I'll be honest. A bit underwhelmed. And, um, yeah, and that's just my shipping information. So, yeah, like I say, it should have been $54.99. It was reduced to $26.99. For what it is, there are some good items in there. I would go as far as to say that the, uh, the grey T-shirt... This one is probably my favourite, uh, just because it is, it's quite cool. I just feel they could have gone a bit better. I feel like the white t-shirt with the cartoon characters on it is a bit poor. Um, the tote bag, why? What, what, what's that for? Like, little disappointed, and that's probably why I normally stick with what I know when it comes to crates and loot bundles, etc. Um, do not be put off, but just know what you're expecting if you are going to order one of these items. I mean, in the future, they might be different, but I do feel like they need to sort of step up the level of quality. And even though it's a small detail, when you advertise your crate or your bundle or your box to look a certain way and it shows up and it's just a brown cardboard box, um, that is a little sort of amateur. But yeah, like I say, the t-shirt will get some wear, the hat will get some wear, the tote bag will probably disappear into obscurity, and the white t-shirt, I believe, will probably end up going to my girlfriend's wear in bed, or I'll wear it to the gym, I don't know. But um, maybe I ought to do a video follow-up and sort of see if the t-shirts and the mug have stood the test of time, but yeah, a little bit underwhelming from the people at lootbundle.com, I'm sorry to say. But do stick around with my channel. Please subscribe to the channel. I do WrestleCrate unboxings on a regular uh, monthly sort of period. If you do have any bundles or crates or anything that you think are extra special and you want me to open them and review them, I will be happy to do so at any time if you think it's something that I will like. But for this time, I have been Mick Bailey, your captivating, charismatic, copper-bearded ginger. It's cold outside, there's no kind of atmosphere, so I better put something warmer on, head outside, and avoid being an enormous smeghead. Peace out. Woo! The following unboxing has been paid for by the CCC. Captivating, charismatic, copper-bearded for life.